Las Vegas real estate market 45 days after coronavirus lockdown. The eye of the Category 5 hurricane coronavirus is still a few months away from the Las Vegas real estate market shores, but it is already negatively affecting the market. And when it hits, based on what we hear from the economic experts, it will be painful. But here is what is going on so far. While home sales have fallen significantly from last April, prices have hardly budged. In this video, we will discuss the Las Vegas housing market for April and the first 15 days of May 2020 and tell you what is in the pipeline. May 15th marks about two and a half months since coronavirus was detected in our city and 45 days since the stay-at-home order on April 1st. Home sales in Las Vegas Metro for April 2020 stood at 1,971, which is down by 31.4% from last April, and the sales numbers for the first 15 days of May stood at 748. If current trends continue, May 2020 sales numbers should be less than half of May 2019 sales of 3,292. Home listings that are not under contract are increasing, albeit slowly, and at the end of April stood at 6,043, which is down by 18.7% from the last April. That puts the all-important months of active listing inventory, which shows the relationship between supply and demand at 3.1 months, which is still very good and in a healthy market would lead to small price gains. The only way to see price cuts is for the months of listing inventory pushing past six months worth. 2,516 new home listings have been published in the MLS, and that is down by 41.6% from the past year. The median price of homes sold shows a 3.3% increase from the same time last year. Condos and townhouses aren't doing any better than single-family homes. While the median price shows the market direction in lower price ranges, the price per square foot ratio of the sold homes has been virtually unchanged in the previous four months. It is the price per square foot that shows whether or not home prices have gone up. Just keep in mind that we had predicted 8% to 10% real price gains for homes in lower price ranges by July 2020, which has evaporated so far. Las Vegas new home market. The new home market is not faring any better, and new home builders had about 1,000 home sales and about 150 cancellations in the last three months before coronavirus. In April 2020, sales contracts dropped to 459 with 215 cancellations, and it gets worse with increasing prices. Only one new home priced higher than $750,000 goes under contract per week. Conclusion as we said, the effect of coronavirus on the Las Vegas housing market has been minimal as far as pricing and active listing inventory is concerned, but sales numbers have fallen significantly. We talk to our investors all the time, and they report that they have lost about 10% of their rental income so far, while the citywide rent delinquency is higher. This number will go up substantially when the unemployment benefits run out at the end of July 2020. On the other hand, Las Vegas gets its visitors from the air and ground, and while some may get into a car and come here, flying is another matter. People may get into planes if they have to, but doing it for fun is doubtful. So no one is predicting economic recovery in Las Vegas before the end of 2021. Fed Chairman Powell said the following in a speech yesterday. The scope and speed of this downturn are without modern precedent significantly worse than any recession since World War II. We see a severe decline in economic activity and employment, and already the job gains of the past decade have been erased. Add more than 25% unemployment, which will come down but not fully recover for a while, and many will be forced to sell their homes or lose it. Thankfully, many homeowners have enough equity in their house to avoid a distressed sale, but listing numbers should go up substantially in the fall of 2020, leading to price drops. On the other hand, some investors may elect to sell due, due, due to decreasing rental income. We are not economic experts, but have listened to many who are, and we are in for a rough ride for a period of time. At this point, there is no doubt that the Las Vegas real estate market will suffer, but we are yet to know by how much. However, we don't think that anyone is as prepared for what comes as, as experienced realtors who have been through the ups and downs of Las Vegas real estate market. 
We have had a great deal of experience dealing with foreclosures and short sales when they come and have sold many residential units in down markets. So we advise if you have to sell your house, do it now or you will wish that you did. Correct pricing is essential in this uncertain market and we are as good as it gets. Call us at 702-478-7800. But we advise buyers to wait for better deals and subscribe to our real estate channel. When the time to buy arrives, we will let you know. If you find Las Vegas real estate market 45 days after coronavirus lockdown useful, please like and share it. This is Karen Sabrazade of Las Vegas Homes, Condos, and Luxury High-Rise Condos wishing you health and happiness. Keep safe.